Hello again, and welcome back to another edition of the Wiccan Conservative. Let me ask you, what makes the Republican form of government the most minority-centric government on the face of this planet? It focuses on the individual, not the group. Last night, Tim Cast was having a discussion about the Trump lawyer who was asked if he would be immune from prosecution for using SEAL Team 6 to assassinate a political rival. The issue with the question is that there is a constitutional process that should come before prosecuting a sitting president or a former president, depending on the crimes. But that got them into a discussion about democracy. And the example that the Tim Cass crew came up with was the pizza party example. If you ask 100 people what type of pizza they would like, you're likely to get around 100 different answers. In a democracy, the majority majority would then force their opinions upon the minority. And then a lot of people would probably be eating pizza that they didn't want to. But in a Republican government, everybody would be able to make their own choice, but they would be responsible for getting that pizza. There would be nobody giving them the pizza and your neighbor could have pineapple on their pizza. You can have pepperoni on yours. But the key is your neighbor would not be able to force you to eat eat their pineapple pizza in a Republican form of government. Those are the main key differences between living in a democracy and living in a democratic republic. But that's all I have for you guys today. I will catch you on the next one.